Modern Mango Farm Harvest Technology and Processing Mango Farm and Harvest The harvesting season of this juicy fruit begins in early June and continues till August. The harvesting season starts after three months when the trees start flowering. Mango farms require a large area of land if someone among you wants to be in this industry. It takes five to eight years for a mango tree to become capable of providing fruits. Mangoes are demanded by several industries, among which juice production companies come on the top. In the same manner, it's also used to make pickles in countries like Bangladesh, Pakistan and India. The country with the maximum production title is held by India. India produces 30% of the mangoes throughout the globe. This list also includes countries like China, Thailand, Mexico, Philippines, Indonesia, Brazil, Nigeria, Haiti, and Egypt. Coming to the video now, the fruits when harvested are brought to the factories where most of these fruits are exported to other countries and also distributed to the local factories which do the juice production. The workers put the fruits on the escalator each by each, where you can even see the specks of dust. The fruits go straight into the water to get dusted off on the same escalator. After the removal of the dust, these fruits are dried now. The workers pick each of them manually and place them in the factory's packaging box. These are packed into various types of packaging based on the demand of the orders the factories received from several vendors. Don't skip the video. How juices are being made in the factory's portion is yet to come. Mango Juice Factory. Oh, dearest viewers, let's take you on the journey where the delicious juice is made for us. This is a juice loved by customers no matter which country they live in. The juicy fruit has magic in its taste. No matter whether you consume it raw or drink its juice, it gives the same joy. The factories produce juices from several varieties of mangoes while few factories adhere to only some specified quality of mangoes. Let's take you to the making process of these juices. The factories directly order the raw fruits from the farms to assure a sweet taste for their mangoes. The factories also play a vital role to educate farmers for cultivating better and yielding mangoes through lucrative techniques that are used in agricultural sectors. Initially, the mangoes are ripe directly in the farms or the ripening chambers. Most of these factories have 20 acres of ripening chambers that hold a capacity to store 150 tons of mangoes. Each ton is equal to 1,000 kilos. To make it certain that the best quality of mangoes should be used in production, mangoes are chosen by a highly skilled workforce. At the beginning of this sub-process, mangoes are sent to a five-stage washing process to dust them off with chlorinated water and then with fresh water. Once this process is complete, the next batch of highly trained workers carries out the process of slicing and cutting the fruits. The sliced fruits are now sent to the manually sorting section. Now the fruits become prepared to be sent for the automated processes. The fruits are then sent towards the latest destoning machine that assists to separate the seeds from the machines while the pulp is sent towards the liquidating machine, which starts to turn the pulp into juices. This machine sends the unwanted fiber and portions of the fruit are removed. Moreover, the pulp is steamed at 64 degrees centigrade. This helps to facilitate the pulp extraction in a much better way. The process doesn't end here. 
but the pulp is put in the giant tube that removes the unwanted particles that are still present. This process can be summarized as four processes that are heating, holding, cooling, and chilling. This process operates on full PLC control. The oil controlling section was standardized and validated under strict observations. As the juice is made to be consumed by humans, the juice is examined very carefully at each stage by food technologists and scientists. Another manner for the production of juices is the manual manner where every process is similar from ripening to sorting to washing to destoning and even the standardization. The only difference that can be seen is sterilization and pasteurization. In this manner, the pulp is pasteurized at 90 degrees while chilled at 8 to 10 degrees. Once the process is carried out in the factory, the pulp is then sent for best-in-class packaging. The factories ensure the use of imported bags for packing the juice drums from Italy. The factories have a large area of 10,000 for storage of the manufactured juices. Bottle of Juice Processing Viewers, this is the place where the delicious mango juices are made and that I and you consume for a soul-touching experience. The rolling escalators pick up the bottles and carry them to the filling section where the fresh juices are already sent. This process continues until the bottles reach their storage capacity. This place is installed with every sort of latest variant of juice processing machines that perform all the processes in a short period. You can see how the flow is going. Once the process of filling is done, the automated system machines take the filled juices to the capping portion where each bottle is capped by the machine. Just after the capping portion, the bottles are escalated to the labeling section, where each bottle is labeled with the useful information that mostly depicts the nutritional value of the product, with pasting the expiry date to provide fresh and refreshing juices to their consumers and avoid the product to be sold as an expired commodity. This juice is considered the best juice in the summer. Tell us in the comments section which juice you like the most.